Okay, there's a new thing going on. I'm starting a new segment to my channel to show you the journey of a writer from writing a novel to completing the novel to editing and then goes the, the pub finding a publisher or what whatever. So uh, I hope you will learn a lot from my mistakes and make a good choices. And this is just a sort of a, a docu series of my journey. So uh, things are going well. I I have I I have to say that because uh, great news, people. I've signed not one but four contracts for the novels that I'm working on. Yay! <laughs> That's so great. However, it, it's me. I'm always skeptical and now I'm thinking, but wait man, it's not just about me now. It's all about all these people that are working with me, like editors and all these other people that helped me, that read my novels and told me what should be corrected, you know, like beta readers and, and all. Uh, I'm working on a fourth novel right now, and in this series that I'm making, I will be talking mostly about that one. So I will be, I will learn from the previous three that I wrote, but I will be speaking about this fourth one. So this fourth one is, of course, I'm, I I want to write about um, science fiction and everything. So it's a new project. It's something that I haven't really tried because uh, I prefer military fiction. Now what I'm working on is sort of um, a futuristic drama, like a romance, like, I don't know, a, a love story, a love triangle. And of course the, the main character is, guess who, a, a writer that, that just tries to succeed in the world. And yeah, I don't want to be, I don't want to make it yeah, it's a love story and everything is based on that, so uh, the setting is a futuristic Belgrade. Belgrade is capital of Serbia and Serbia is in the Balkans and Balkans is in the Europe, um, Eastern Europe, you know, so what I wanted to do as in the background, I'm sort of um, criticizing the this class divided society from um, people who are in the elite echelons of the of the group so they, they are on the top and the people who are poor you know they're just normal people so what would it take for somebody who is in a low class to climb to the top class so this is his journey, yeah, the main character is a, is a guy, surprise, surprise. So I'm excited and uh, I'm learning a lot about this stuff because I haven't wrote something this sort of insightful. It's a first person, it's written in the first person. So you'll get the chance to see everything, the way he feels, what he thinks, um, his moral dilemmas and, and everything that's going on and so far the, and now this is the, the wild thing because I wrote about 20 pages it took me four days, 5000 words a day that's some my, that's like a norm for me uh, what happened? I send it that text, like a, a test, you know, just to see how do people, you know, uh, what, what do they feel about this, you know, what do they think about this. And the people I'm working with, 
were surprised well, well surprised and they offered me a contract like yeah we, we, we want to publish this and it's crazy it's not even finished and they were surprised and overwhelmed so this is a very good thing now if I'm away from blogging because I'm mostly well writing stories for my blog if you don't see me there this is why because I'm working on an off yeah. uh, I'm out of words and because I'm out of words this is how I am calling this new novel out of words so you just that's the title <laughs> great how you've been <laughs> oh my god uh, the comments I don't know let's socialize I got Facebook I got Twitter you know comments in the YouTube you name it you can say anything you want now if you have a story of your own and you would like to post it somewhere I'm open for a collaboration I can make it uh, a audio story from your work and yeah I give you some promotion why not so I can post it here and say oh this great author you may buy his book here or there or what not and if you're a poet even better I like poems I'm not good at them of course I mean, why of course? Of course, because it's, I don't know, it's so abstract to me. But they're very good poets, and I found them a lot on, on WordPress. It's crazy, you know, if you're a blogger and you're just there, you're gonna find a lot of poems that are just, you know, it, it blew my mind. Sometimes I, I, I cannot stop reading them. I read them twice or three times it's crazy how good they are and these people are also trying to succeed trying to make a name of themselves so that's kind of encouraging and good and so this what I'm doing is uh, a way for them to kind of expand a little bit now if you're not a writer or a poet and you're just like the stories and you have great ideas I may suggest you my patreon account where you can provide me with your idea and I will make a story or a poem or an illustration you can take a pick or I can do all three why not so that's one option of course where you can help me and all my earnings are not being spent on just regular stuff no I'm planning to use those to publish my books you know expenses for publishing or whatnot you know going on promotions and all that stuff that writer must do I mean we live in such time where author must be very very active in social media and, and just hanging out with, with everybody so yeah that could be very very useful and I would be very grateful for your help you know so yeah that, that's just the option where what you can do and if not you can always read free stories that I post on my blog you can watch these videos and audio stories that I make and audio poems and illustration tutorials and all this other stuff yeah tell me what you're interested in and I can just send you a link to all these uh, great bloggers that I met and they're really 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 good you know so that would be it 
for my first video of this series and um, I, I don't know I hope you like it and if you can press that subscribe button I think it's around there I don't know uh, that would be awesome if you can follow me on my blog that would be awesome too and Twitter and that Facebook thing that nobody's using I'm fine with that too yeah so you got your options and yeah I think you're smart enough and adult enough to make your own decisions so I will leave that up to you uh, thank you for watching this and uh, I hope I'll have a lot more to tell you in the next video so stay tuned take care and bye